Hi, my name is Nicole with So Much More. Today we'll be making cork strap extenders with cotton fabric accents. But before we get started, subscribe to my channel and share this video with your sewing friends. If you like anything that you see, don't forget to click the thumbs up icon. You can access the cutting measurements by visiting my website. The link is in the description. Once you cut your pieces to the correct length, you're going to fuse the SF-101 or Shape Flex to the wrong side of the cotton straps. And you're going to fold them in half and press them, and then fold the long ends to the middle press line. And you'll do that to both of the cotton pieces. First, you're going to want to inspect the cork, make sure that there's no cracks or peeling of the cork from the base fabric. This piece looks really good. We're going to draw a line right down the middle. I'm just going to use my acrylic ruler and this uh, clover chalk. It's a really handy tool. I like it for the back of this especially because it's white and the back of the cork fabric is black so it's easy to see. So I'm just going to make a mark down the center at the back of that cork fabric. And then I'm going to be taking this fusible tape. This is really convenient, especially for this purpose. And I'm going to apply it on both sides of the marked line. What's nice about this tape is that you don't have to iron it on. You just press it down and then the, uh, the protective covering just peels right off. It's really convenient. It's pretty sticky. So then you're going to be taking the bottom of that long side, one of the sides, and folding it up to meet that middle mark that you'd made. And do that all along this bottom edge. I like to use this seam roller from Violet Craft and just press that down a little bit. Since you can't iron top of cork. This seam roller by Violet Craft does a really great job. And then you're going to be doing the same thing to the other side. Just fold that cork fabric up right next to the edge of the first folded cork fabric. You don't want to leave a gap or anything, so you'll do that all the way to the end. You can take your seam roller and just press that down. And we're going to go to the sewing machine and we're going to stitch along both sides of that about an eighth of an inch away from the middle. Once you finish your stitches, you'll just want to inspect that. Check both sides to make sure the stitching looks good. And now we're going to add the cotton strap accent to the cork strap. And we're going to be putting some more of that tape right along the middle of that. And then we'll be placing the cotton strap on top of the cork. We're going to use the tape to help that stick together. It just makes it easier to sew since you can't use pins uh, when you're working with cork fabric. It'll leave permanent holes in your material. So just lay that tape along the cork fabric just right in the middle there 
And again, that pulls away really easily. And now you'll take your fabric accent piece and line that up on top of the cork strap and just press that down. And now you'll be sewing along the folded edge of the cotton fabric down both sides about one eighth of an inch away from the edge. And it's really that simple. You have a fabric accented cork strap. I'm going to use these for the strap extenders on a bag. Let me show you the finished product. 